Well, a Bosman Park family's long and difficult backyard battle to save their cubby house has come to an end, for the moment at least. The Montgomery family built their tree house 18 months ago for their three kids and it's recently been at the centre of an almighty neighbourhood dispute. Last night, the Mosman Park Council voted to uphold a complaint from one of their neighbours. It effectively means the cubby house is coming down. Mosman Park Mayor Ron Norris joins us this morning. Good morning to you, Mayor. Talk us through last night's decision. What was it that convinced you and your fellow councillors to order the Montgomery's to take their cubby house down? Well, Tim, this was an illegal structure and once it became a public issue, council really had to finally make a decision one way or the other. It was a difficult choice for council because the easiest thing to do is to leave something as simple as a cubby structure alone. But there are the interests of the neighbours and in this case it introduced an overlooking problem and that was the reason why I think most councillors supported the decision not to approve the structure. All right, so how long do the Montgomery's have before they have to pull it down? How many more days do the kids get to enjoy it? Oh, there won't be. I don't think there's any rush for that to occur. I think normal procedures would, would uh, flow from here. Uh, I, we would expect the Montgomery's to act in good faith and remove the structure in, uh, as uh, early as possible. But I don't think uh, Council's particularly excited about when that occurs. Is this the end of the matter now as far as you're concerned or can the family take this any further? Oh, this is a matter, this is a planning matter and in all planning matters every applicant has the right to appeal to the State Administrative Tribunal but that is a rather long and tortuous process and I suspect for a, a, an issue of this nature they wouldn't wish to go down that path but that's entirely up to them. The answer to your question, yes there is a right of appeal but we'll wait developments in that area. All right, so this is uh, one of those situations where I think a lesson has been learned the hard way. What would your advice be to other families who might be thinking about putting a cubby house or a tree house up in their backyard? In Bosman Park there are many cubbies, tree houses and swings in the town and as long as they exist without causing problems we don't really have a view on that. But in this case we have a substantial structure that does have an adverse impact on a neighbour and that all could have been avoided had the applicant sought approval for the structure and that consultation with the neighbours occurred before it was constructed we would never have had the problem we've now had simply because it was built first and approval sought after. So the answer to your question again is uh, seek approval first and uh, then I think we would avoid all these problems. Can I ask you just lastly, if they had sought approval before, would their chances of it being approved been any better than it has been now applying retrospectively? I think we would have resulted in a different structure, Tim. It would have been, I suspect, a less a high structure and it certainly would have been further from the boundary than what has been constructed uh, but more importantly the neighbours would have been consulted at the early stage rather than at the end of the process so the answer is yes not the same structure but uh, something similar and certainly with no intrusion or adverse effect on the neighbours. All right, Mosman Park Mayor Ron Norris appreciate your time this morning thank you.